Hello my friend, I'm Ed here from DigitalLifestyle.com. I want to ask you this simple question. How would you live your life differently if you knew you could not fail? I know it's a simple question, yet it's incredibly powerful and profound. For so many of us, it's really the fear of failure that stops us from pursuing our dreams, from creating the life that we really want to live and to aspire to be the best that we possibly can. So I wanted to know what these dreams were and these aspirations were for real people. And what I learned when I asked this question is that for most people, these dreams were not fantasy dreams that, that had never been achieved. They were dreams that others were living. Yet for so many of us, we stopped short from pursuing those very dreams because of the fear of failure. So I went out there and I asked this question. How would people live their lives differently if the fear of failure was completely removed? And I want to share this common human experience in the hopes that it provokes the same thought in you like it did in me. I hope you enjoy the video. What would you do if you knew you could not fail? Go ahead. <laughs> That's not fair. I'd run the marathon. Run a marathon. I'd win and not fail. Exciting. Yeah. What about you? You'd probably run your own business if you thought it would succeed and not fail. Take more risks, wouldn't you? I would. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I guess, I mean, we're at a later stage of life, so I guess looking back, you yeah, know, would, would it be nice to take more risks? Of course it would, and maybe taking a different path, but, you know, we are where we are, you do what you do, it's not been so bad. So I think, um, yeah, and I think some, um, you know, trying to reach out for something is, is really important. When I was studying at university, I was, or before university, I always wanted to become a veteran surgeon, and I never did. So. Um, that's probably academic ability, not having enough motivation, I don't know. If you knew you could not fail in whatever endeavor you pursued, mm. what would you do? In I want to live my dreams. If I know I wouldn't be failing, I'll make this world in such a place that there's a distribution in such a way that everybody really gets what they want. Otherwise, it's concentrated and focused at A, B and Z. And there are the people who are struggling to such an extent that they don't have it and there are others who are too greedy wanting to have it. So I know equality is a very different statement to do but I would at least ensure that I could move ahead in that fashion because you're assuring me no failures. What else do I want? So that's a dream. It's like I don't want to die before that if that's what you're going to be telling me that I would not fail. We, we live life, you know, all of us with certain fears and I think yes. uh, I'm yes. guilty of that. The fear uh, of failure? Yes, the fear of failure. Yes. And if I were to be able to do something and know absolutely that I can succeed in a financial way you know, uh, uh, and uh, not worry about those kind of things. Uh, I'm, I'm an adventure seeker. I love adventure and I can see myself uh, going out uh, to different places, different countries, uh, maybe uh, off the beaten path kind of places and yes. photographing and maybe making filming documentaries. I'm with you. <laughs> I'm with you. And just exploring the world. Yes. And, uh, and if I had a bucket loads of money and I didn't have to worry financially about certain things, uh, that's something I could see myself being totally happy you know, doing. I think we wanted to, um, I think we, both of us are dreaming uh, of um, launching our own uh, textile industry. <laughs> maybe I will learn a lot of uh, other languages maybe, 
mm -hmm. just to be able to share more with people and to be sure that I could do it. Could not fail. Fail. I knew I could not fail. Uh, um, if I knew I could not fail at doing anything, anything, any career, I think I would be a comedian or an improv comedian. Just something uh, that I've always loved, and I don't think there's any better feeling to me than being able to make other people laugh. Uh, I love that feeling. If I can, if I can get it done. Every lawyer is a little bit of a comedian. I think uh, I'm doing what I'm doing because being a comedian is is like being a musician or being a, being TV or being a dancer. You, it's high risk, high reward, right? What would you do if you knew you could not fail? I think I would try everything possible. I wouldn't stop trying new things. Um, the reason why I'm out here and on my way to Asia is because I wasn't sure if I was. Um, doing it out of habit because that's what I thought I was supposed to do or because other people told me that I should do it or I would be good at it but now I need to figure out what makes me happy. I always wanted to be an actor. <laughs> I never really did anything about it just because I was too shy and I thought it would be stupid to try so when I come home I'm hoping to try and get into film, maybe not necessarily be an actor. I'd probably try and go to London actually and try out acting out there. What would you do differently in your life if you knew you just could not fail? So I deal with people. Um, I really like working with people. I've tried the office job for a lot of time. But my most, um, my most important passion for me is nature and the environment. And uh, I really want to help in some way or another. Uh, I also like photography, so I'd like to pursue photography and the environment. So I'm considering you know, focusing on environmental science, and then with that, I can, you know, have some sort of marketing strategy or um, advertising um, along with that. So it's going to obviously help in some way the environment, which I think is the most important. Thing. What would you do differently if you knew you could not, you could just not fail? I want to go back to Pakistan and work with women and children because I think back home in India and Pakistan, these issues back home are with issues concerning women and children. I mean, women back home can't even be depressed if you have a family. It's not an idea or concept that's really welcome.